our life. It should be the theme of our life if it is not already. Um, and so I wanted to read a poem that talks about black women. Um, and all of this poem names the South. It's talking about everywhere. Um, everywhere black women are important and we matter and we build everything. So this poem is called, I Cannot Talk About the South Without Talking About Black Women. Hello. And those of you who are taking photos, don't get on my dry list. I've had a mask on. <laughs> 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 My grandmothers made America, made the fibers that made us warm, made us invincible heroines. To tell you who they are, I must start with who they are not. Servants, kitchen-bound mammies, silently obedient wives. We can't, in our modern comfort, Imagine the survival they learned was theirs to claim. Can't hold the light they burned through this colonial darkness. What tricks this nation, this American South, pulled minute by minute to keep my grandmothers convinced. The body you're in is not enough. Your race and your gender work together to mark you less, to mark you takeable. But what they didn't know was that my grandmothers still had an unmovable strength, enough from here, enough to build a bridge from here to heaven. I know when I leave this broken earth, I'll find them there, sweetening every hour. Yeah. My grandmothers raised a generation of American men. There is no other way to say this. Look at any Southern family and you'll find somewhere in a past most will not claim a black woman. Come on. Yes. These men who call themselves bootstrapping and self-made, somewhere there's a black woman and her unthanked hands who lifted them to where they are now. Yes, yes ma'am. My father tells the story of the sons of his grandmother's employers. How they, instead of the pension she was promised, decided to give her a damned old tire, an old suitcase, dusty in the yard. What thanks is this for the years she raised that family, for the care they cannot forget? My father could never forgive those men, their Southern tradition, their American tradition. Even now, they tell us black women are going to save this whole nation with votes or magic or our style taken and renamed. But this is no longer the land of masses and mammies, and we are only superheroines for our own daughters and sons. Yes, sir. My grandmothers did not give their lives for me to keep nursing this country, mm -hmm. to keep chucking and jiving in a bizarro American dream. My grandmothers are worth more than this corrupt remembering. Now, there is no room for the Dixieland lie. We no longer hold these truths you made us accept. Under God, yes, we hear him sing the song of powerful love despite the united hate of America. Grandmothers, women made of salt and spirit, you are faith continuous. Continue us. Raise us to be heroes and heroines, to tell this country that we are not mules, not beasts. You, an army of workers and wives, we hid our fears and woes in your indestructible, ever-present ladiness. The blood you pass down to us is all we will ever need to save our lives. Yes. Yes. Mm. Mm. Mm.